Sydney hits home. Kickoff time almost upon us. A colossal game featuring two teams who demonstrably belong on the big stage. We know they can deliver, but will they do it with the pressure on and the fans wired in? Well, the weather forecasters promised us an agreeable day for football, and that's exactly what we've got. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson, and ready for what should be a pulsating game, the second match for both sides here at the Euros. It's Slovakia, and they take on Ukraine. Well, Derek, these were very good in their opening games. Both look to be in top form. This should be a great game today. Can they convert? Well, here it is again, and it's a superbly weighted through ball to break that defensive line. And when he gets onto it, he decides to go for power. It's a really emphatic finish, which gives the keeper no chance. The match has restarted. 1 0 here. Kutska. Onto Lobotka. Kutska. And you can sense the threat is there. in the middle can he find the angle and a useful cross well no real accuracy and easy for the keeper Sudakov The attack looks promising. It might be on for them. Determined defending. Sigankov. to get tighter and threading it through oh no it's gone a begging well they can't miss opportunities like that what a chance to equalize Stepanenko Mudrik. An alert intervention. Not a bit of an unforced error, and it's going to be a throw. Artem Dovbik. On the ball, Tara Stepanenko. Teamwork and passing in evidence. Alexander Zinchenko. Nicely timed tackle. Now Zinchenko. Artem Dovbik. And possibilities inside the box. Can he do it? Well, as the replay shows, this is all about his ability to find space in the box, which then makes the finish look so much easier. That's good play from him.
2-0 here and the ball is moving again Duda and take it away Skriniar well moving the ball forward they might be in business Denis Vavro Duda and now with Kutska shaping to shoot couldn't put it away and they're still trailing by a couple of goals well you certainly can't fault their effort but they just can't get back into this game can they Really clever pressing. He continues his run. And still trying to get the shot off. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Lobotka it's with Duda plenty of options who can he pick out oh to trim back the lead and both hands on it good goalkeeping Sudakov Read it well. Stanislav Lobotka. Can he find the net? Still a chance. Well, defensive Brazilians there. Well, it was a chance for them to get back into this one, but they were denied by a great piece of goalkeeping, you have to say. Really good, strong tackle, and it'll be a throw in. And time for the change now. And an easy one to cut out, really. And play halted, free kick given. Denis Vavro. And Pekarek in possession. Kutska. And options in the centre. Lobotka. Well, he's just pulled off a great save there. What reaction from the goalkeeper that was. And over it comes. Appeared to be in two minds. Great defending. Well, the power was there. Not really the placement, however. Goal kick. Well, there you have it. Too many chances spurned. Creating opportunities hasn't been an issue. Taking them has. It's been a really frustrating day for them. Well, in an advanced position, looking to remedy that here. danger here as he runs at them and players waiting in the center well adding up all the stoppages we will have two extra minutes Peter Pekarik and a corner kick the referee's verdict
Can someone get on the end of this? Well, it has come to nothing. Vavro. Oh, this looks useful. Can he put it in? Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Who can they pick out? That's a good-looking ball. And there it is! Still life left in this game. And they have the momentum now. Well, let's look at this again. To pick out this pass shows wonderful vision. It's inch perfect, but I think the keeper has made a mistake here. While it's a decent finish, it shouldn't go in at that near post. And the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Well, he's been the standout for his side so far, don't you think, Stuart? Yeah, he's done okay in that first half. He's had a lot of the ball, he's used it well, and he's been energetic. But unfortunately, that can't be said about the rest of the team, who need to improve if they're going to turn this around. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Can he find the right pass? And delivered into the box. Well, not the best clearance. Threat over for now, it seems. Well, just a quick reminder, more live football coming your way here on EA TV. I think you might enjoy this game. Well, the fixtures are coming thick and fast. It should be a good game, that. Hopefully, I've not just given it the commentator's curse. Fluency of movement. And just like that, they don't have the ball anymore. Well, wow, there's a really stylish piece of running. Zinchenko. A promising looking attack, but comes to nothing in the end. Peter Pekarik. Robert Bozhenik. He could pick out a teammate. And in the right position to make sure it didn't go all the way through. Wonderfully weighted pass. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. Well, he's given it away. And that is going to be a free kick. You saw what the intent was, but just overcooked. And so 30 minutes left for play in this one. Promising attack, this. Is it going to be? And there it is! A two-goal cushion now, and they just need to keep the concentration. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal. And from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. Well, it's a tale of four goals in this match now. 3-1 it is. Bozhenik. 
And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Now here's a match coming up on EA TV that I think you're going to want to join us for. And what a game that will be. Two good teams in a great stadium. I'm really looking forward to that one. Lost possession. Definitely look as though they want to make this move count. Timely intervention. Not all that convincing defensively. Well, able to survive that attacking push. Denis Vavro. Here's Duda. See some progress with the ball at his feet. He might be able to carve something out. And a goal to delight the fans. Just what they were hoping for. Well, just look at his strength here. He holds off the challenge, he keeps his balance, and he finds the back of the net. It's a wonderful goal. On with the game then. 3-2. What will happen next? 20 minutes to go. Stanislav Lobotka. Duda. Promising looking ball. Oh, so close to opening up the defence. Well, good run and good ball control. Duda. And play halted, free kick given. And with play stop, they will make the change now. And deliver towards the back post. And clears the danger. Doing well to win it back. What can they do from here? Really good block. And the referee felt he had to blow the whistle. Georgi Sudakov. Here's Malinowski. Opportunity to deliver the cross. And fed forwards. Well, he's been ruled offside. Denis Vavro. That's very effective. Good high pressing. Skriniar. Lobotka. It's with Milan Skriniar. And he read it well defensively. Giving it their all in search of an equaliser. Well, dealt with that ball comfortably. And he couldn't quite get himself back on side, Stuart. Well, as a player, you need to be able to change your mind. But he wasn't able to, and that's a poor pass.
Konoplia. And very nicely positioned to win it back. David Hansko. And Pekarik in possession. It's with Milan Skriniar. Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Now still pressing for a goal here. Well, what an opportunity, but really good defending, you've got to say. Well, that's a good deflection. That'll be a corner. Trying to deliver it accurately. Corner once more. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. Well, I take my hat off to him because that was superb defending. Is it going to be? A smart stop here. And the referee blows for full time. It is a victory for Ukraine. Stuart, your analysis. Yes, Derek, there wasn't much in it, to be honest. Really competitive game with chances at both ends, but they probably just about edged it overall and deserved the result in the end. And I don't think, Stuart, anyone can really quibble about what he put into the game. Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.